this blogger and founding editor of the OP Life, Irene Gianos, is here. The OP Life, tell us what OP Life means before we get get started. Yeah. Okay, so it's not Ocean Pacific. Yeah. No, it's not. Although a lot of people might think that in our generation. OP stands for on purpose. So I am here to encourage people to help people design their best life. So we talk about fashion, beauty, healthy living, lots of mindset, because it all starts in there. And every Friday we have something called Fuzzy Fridays. Right. And that's what I'm showing today. I'm doing the man bow set. Yeah, Fuzzy okay. Friday is uh, how you should be seeing the world after what we're about to make. <laughs> that means. So it's double meaning. I'm doing half a cup of orange juice, by the way. And we're making something called man bow set. Man bow set. Okay, so. Sorry, I'm like, that's okay. That's okay. We have the recipe on the screen here, so uh, we'll also have it on our website after the uh, show is over here. But can we start off with a little bit of orange juice? Because it juice. is a, a mimosa type of drink so far. Right. And you can have this any day of the week for brunch or whatever we got. Now, the reason it's a manmosa, the biggest difference is what? Well, I thought, you know, a lot of, you know, to start drinking early, you know, games are early. A lot of, you know, we do, um, let me do the tablespoon of the Cointreau, the orange liqueur. You know, we have um, another designated sober oh, driver. Oh, okay, so I have take a little, a little alcohol. there. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, right. to the bitters. Um, just to have something a little bit richer. Uh, for the men, you know, kind of a twist on the traditional beer. And so depending on what kind of beer you use, you're gonna, you can use the Scheinerbach, the regular. What would you recommend? Uh, well, it depends on your taste. So do you okay. like um, richer flavor? Then this is for you. Um, or if you like a lighter, lighter beer. beer. I even have the, the light, the 55, for those of us <laughs> who are watching our. You can totally see the difference. In that. Yeah, yeah the totally. Beer. Yeah, and then you want to just garnish it with your orange, you can. But the Fuzzy Friday originally, yeah, yeah. just um, for you to sell it away, it's not about the alcohol, but I mean, of course, it makes it fun, but it's about celebrating your wins, celebrating the things that you're doing in life, you know, um, toasting to yourself. And so um, it's not necessarily about the drinks, but it always makes it fun. Yeah. All right. Now, your website here has a lot of that information on it as well. What inspired right. you to kind of get it going? Um, all of these passions that I had um, to help people do these things and be their best selves made me want to do that. So, and I brought it all together in one place. And they can also find this recipe, by the way, in the Home and Garden magazine. Over this front of that. There you go. Pretty cool. I love the fact, you know, passions. You talk about that. People that find their passions and say, you know what, I want to share my passions. And that mm -hmm. is really what makes, you know, makes a uh, tailgate, uh, great ideas always come together. And right. people just share their passions more and more. Right, right. You know? And then if you love what you do, You'll be happy in life, right? Yeah, right, right? I mean, yeah. seriously. You'll have Fuzzy Fridays. Yeah, do I know. That's right. right. Her from now on for Fuzzy That's Friday. right. Come this is really fun. And this is something a guy can do, order, and feel good about it. And these are things, I mean, you may not have the quantra in your house, but you can stir it up with your chopsticks. You can, it's orange juice and beer. It's really and good. Oh, wait, I didn't stir mine. Yeah. Okay. I have the protein in that you just don't think you eat during a tailgate party, no. but it's there. Thanks so much. Okay, board council is about to change all that. We're going to show you how. Plus, there's a new pet pick of the week winner. All right, we're going to show you what it is. We'll find out who won all this and all that more right here on Tailgating Oklahoma. Hey! There we go. We should do it.